Hello, my name is Karx82, and welcome back to our FTB Interactions series. Last episode, we got all the bronze machines set up, so that will get us kind of going into the next age, which is the LV age, or steel. So if you look at the LV machine hall, we are going to need... Uh, tin cables and LV machine casings and we need that um, we're gonna need some steel to get that so that's kind of like the main goal of the Bronze Age is to get us into uh, steel now looking I've been kind of looking around and there is I think it looks like it wants us to build the infernal furnace to get our first steel, if I'm looking at that correctly. Now, usually there is like a like a primitive blast furnace, but it looks like that is not. Yeah, it doesn't look like that is a thing. I did. I thought I did see one. Yeah. But uh, I don't know if that is actually, I don't know if that's actually like a thing, to be honest, because I don't know, maybe it is. I mean, oh, yeah, we can make all this stuff, can't we? Hmm. I don't know, because usually this is the way you get less uh, steel, but this is kind of pushing us in a different direction. But it does look like it is locked behind the coke oven, which uh, we're going to need a lot of clay for that. Um, we have a, a little bit, but it is not enough. I'm just going to throw, I'm so kind of unorganized, but this is kind of my Greg Tech chest at the moment. Didn't mean to clean this. I made a cauldron. You just drop it in the cauldron and then it it washes off the impure stuff i've been meaning to do that for a while so glass dust i'm assuming is going to want us to get glass tubes that's why it gave it to us so we will not use that for anything um yeah i think we are good to go though it's a kind of annoying that it is raining but uh, we bring a potion with us, just in case. Now, I do have my crazy jackhammer. And I was going to do in the sieves or whatever, but then I'm like, what am I talking about? Why don't I just... Why don't I just go out in the world and get it? I don't know why I was like, duh, it spawns in the world. And there is a thing over here. I'm pretty sure... Those are like clay. It spawns more in uh, wet biomes or humid biomes, I guess. Swamps. I should get away from. There's some scary stuff out in this ocean. It's kind of annoying that it's raining today, but oh well, what are we gonna do? Hopefully I have a decent amount of time, but uh, I like the world gen so far. I think those big kind of tall plateau things are pretty cool. Yeah, this is a bit farther than I realized. Alright, there we go. Man, remember when those things just <laughs> broke? Um, should we? I'm, I'm always so worried I'm gonna like lose it. And I shouldn't hit stuff with my weapons. Oh, I was like, what is that? Yeah, the flowers. 
<laughs> they act a bit weird. Alright, nice. There is... We can use the... Uh, vein miner or whatever, or excavator on the clay. Alright, how much do we have? What do we need? Like eight stacks or something we figured we needed? We need lots and lots. The nice thing about the Vein Miner is it, it brings all the drops to you too, which is pretty cool. Should we get some salt while we're here? You can use that in cooking. That reminds me, I should get uh, cooking with blockheads going as well. I got some stuff sorted out for our food, but usually you need uh, metals and stuff. All right, that is plenty of that is plenty of clay, I think. All right, let me uh, we'll meet you back at the base. Ooh, it's getting dark. I need to get out of here. Yeah, I just remember. Uh, yeah, back in the day, that would have like destroyed my boat. Uh, I'll be back at the base. All right, we are back, and I'm going to. I'm just actually gonna drink that. Might as well. And I think we need. Let's see if I'm doing this math right. 116 of these. If that is correct, because. We need coke oven bricks, and this does not have a recipe, so I think the only way to do it is that, but maybe I'm missing something, which wouldn't be unheard of. <laughs> Alright, 116. What's that? 112, so I need four more. Alright. So we have a bunch of extra clay, which that is good. So I'm assuming we can just, I don't know, is there like a limit? I don't want to like waste all this stuff if there is, but let's just try it out. All right. I don't know if that takes like longer the more you put in. I really don't know, actually. I'm assuming it's just kind of, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I don't think it matters. Oops. It's so weird just throwing stuff in the... <laughs> it's so weird just throwing stuff in the uh, a fire. Alright, but uh, there we go. There is that. We should have 29. Yes. So we got the 24 for that, and then we need 5 for this, so we need... Four more plates and two buckets. I don't know if it actually uses the bucket. Um, I don't mind having extra buckets though, so. I was like 12 to one bucket, but it's actually. Why don't we do, uh, let's do. Uh, what did I say I needed? We need four plus seven. We need about 12, 12 um, plates, which would be, we got all the masks going on. That's eight, that's 16. Oh well, we'll use them. Oh wow, we filled that up. <laughs> No, pull that out. Might as well. I did notice this thing uh, fills up. This heats up way faster than I remember them. So I it got up to about here. So it actually is viable. Unfortunately, at night it doesn't produce it. But I thought it would get up to about here, and then it would turn night, and then it would go down again. Um, but it does appear to be getting pretty uh, hot. 
during the day, which is pretty cool. Fortunately, it was raining, so I kind of messed it up. All right, so we'll try. Oh, what was the bucket recipe again? Oh, it's in the in this thing. There it is. Alright, so I can actually get rid of those. Hatch. Alright, it does use them. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. I wasn't quite sure. That'd be funny if that used my my thing, but alright, there we go. There is that. Block of coal coke. Pretty cool. I don't know what we will use it for, because usually you use it to make steel and the blast primitive blast furnace, but uh, I'm pretty sure that is, it does appear that is, that's done. Now there is a improved coke oven, which is a multi-block, but this does require circuits, so not quite there yet, but yeah, I'm like really curious. I may test to see if the primitive thing works, because... Oh, wait, there's no controller. What am I talking about? That's right. Um, you would need to craft up the controller for it, and that is... It looks like it's disabled. Yeah, I figured that was not going to be a thing that we could do. Alright, uh, coke oven. Pretty simple. Just the usual... Three by three. Um, Multiblock man. Maybe we'll go back here. Just kidding. <laughs> Forgot that was there. I have got to get this base organized here. How about in this wall right here? Forgot I got the starlight infusion craft or luminous crafting table, but we couldn't progress because we didn't have brass. But now we have brass, we can actually start progressing in that. So, go. I'm assuming it's just an empty multi block. Do it that way. Do that and that. The yeah, there it is. The um, the immersive engineering ones where it's a full. You put the block on the middle. Like always weirds me out. So there we go. We can start producing some charcoal. I guess eh, I probably shouldn't do it all for now. Just do sixteen. But if we put that in there, oops. It's not where I wanted that. I wasn't sure if that actually had a inventory. Wait a second. Does that not uh is that not how that <laughs> works? Am I crazy? Any log wood? Yeah, any log wood. Um, work. Like, why isn't it? <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, all right, I was just looking at the thing. Does this need to be on the, the side? Must be centered on the side. <laughs> uh, did that? Yep, it says right there. Uh, I totally did not see that at all on the tooltip. That is uh, that is funny. There it goes. All right, now we're working. Does that close? It doesn't close. I thought it would be cool if that like closed or whatever. Um, all right, I don't think we need... I'll just leave it. I was just going to say I don't think we actually need to have the site open or anything. Although that may be... That may be a way to automate it. I actually don't know. 
Um, I don't have a. I'll borrow this one. I'm like, I don't have an easy way to get into that. All right, just I'm curious if this. Works like that. All right, it does kind of. All right, I don't know if we need to do that at the moment, but uh, that does indeed work. Okay, that's cool. Um, I'll probably craft up another chest when we need it. But all right, there is our first charcoal. And uh, like I said, there is a improved version of it, but we can't do that yet. Um, kind of bugs me because of the blue. But it looks like to get started in LV and creating more advanced muscles, we will get the research required to construct the Infernal Furnace. So let's do that. Bellows and inf the Infernal Furnace. At least it's... Uh, I will say the mod pack's kind of giving you the, the required the research pretty easy. You're not having to kind of like spam research stuff. Oh, there's the ever full urn. Um, where is artifice, right? Yes. All right. I'm now ready to begin crafting this stuff up. Goggles of revealing brass with these things old. I mean, nothing too crazy. I don't have any leather, though. We can get leather that way. Is there any other way to get leather? We get it in this, don't we? I might actually have a bunch of leather. What am I talking about? Maybe not. Did I leave it in there? I feel like I got a lot of leather. I just never... Um... What did I do with all the leather? Am I being blind again? I should name that. This is the name of the series. Am I blind? <laughs> Alright. I know I had a whole bunch of leather. There it is. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't have a whole bunch, but I have some leather. All right, uh, let's see. Ah, here it is. So, another bricks. <laughs> there is an easy way to easier way is that's how I. This is how I found the primitive blast furnace. Is this recipe actually? So you craft the things. The yeah, primitive blast. We can't craft that. That's why it doesn't work. So fire bricks, compressed fire bricks, fire grass gray. Brick dust and clay dust. All right. Well, we just got a whole bunch of clay. And I'm like, are we, do we have to like feed this? Like, am I going to like flux my base like crazy here? <laughs> I'm like worried I'm going to like turn my base and I don't think it's going to happen right away, but getting into magic this early kind of freaks me out a little bit. Usually I wait. Activate with Salus Mundus, the initial rate is blah blah Don't you need to feed it? Um, I thought you needed to feed it. Like V. Oh, maybe, is that... It just pulls it, does it pull it from the air? Is that... I'm getting Thawncraft 6 and Thawncraft 4 mixed up. Um, of course, because there's no nodes or anything, is there? Yeah, what am I talking about? All right, let me kind of figure out... Or let me get some crafted up here. Um, yeah, I think we'll do that. So we need 12 of those. I'm just trying to figure out like 48 of these. So, oh, that's easy. We need 24 bricks. That's like way less than I was thinking it would be. Yeah, let's just do 32. That's a nice, just kidding. Do I have to throw these in the... Oh, and fire. That's right. The dock. 
Yeah. You don't smelt it directly. There we go. All right. Uh, yeah, let me cut here. Let me get some of this crafted up, I guess. Ooh, 12 obsidian. I don't have enough for 12 obsidian. All right. <laughs> let me... Uh... Yeah, let me figure out what we want to do here, and we'll come back. All right, I'm back. I'm over at this lava pool, uh, just right here. Uh, there is a couple of them, so I'm just going to throw down some water. And then I can always just... I can always just... Uh, use the transmutation thing to get the obsidian or the lava back if we need it. All right, I'm probably going to do that. Now, thankfully, this thing breaks pretty quick. I don't know how deep this lava thing is. Usually there's a little bit, yeah, in the middle. But there we go. I'll grab a couple more just for the EMC if we need it. I know. I, oh, <laughs> almost fell in there. Got to be careful with that. Um, I know using the tablet for EMC isn't probably the intended route. Uh, after the after you leave the void world, but nice back down we need it but uh i don't know i quite like, i just like having the the thing especially because i can just dump my gravel and cobble when i'm mining and stuff i like being able to just throw that in there so that is the obsidian that we're gonna need and the lava i think you need to throw a lava thing in the middle of this furnace I love how, like, it's just so random I have. <laughs> oh! That was... very clumsy. Alright, there we go. Back in there. So we need 12 obsidian, and then we need one lava. I might as well put that that ready because I'm gonna have to handle lava and we also need this so you can't pulverize the singular bricks down you have to well mace rate them um, the brick dust you can do it if you do a mortar but I would rather use a machine to do it and there's no small recipe for that so we'll just do that and you get four it's pretty quick yeah so we can see that uh, it doesn't get all the way up but it gets pretty hot uh, during the day which is which is cool I like that um, it makes it sort of viable at least since you can't sleep through the night all right so there is that Fire clay dust, and then this just gets compressed. Right. It doesn't get smelted, it gets compressed. So now we're using the machines that we. Now we're using the machines that we. Uh... Oh my goodness, that we crafted up last episode, because we hadn't quite done them yet. <laughs> also, I know we're going to need this sooner than later. Do I have any? I do have rubber trees. Do I not have any rubber logs? I thought I had rubber logs. I do. I don't need to plant that yet, but uh, you can always extract this stuff. 
Is that not? Is that not? Can you not extract those logs? I thought you could. Maybe they have to go into centro, centrifuge. Ah, you can. That's what you do. Yeah. All right. I thought you could. Oh, it's a sticky resin. What am I talking about? Sticky resin, not rubber logs. Of course not. It's the uh, the sticky resin. I don't remember. I thought we got some. Did I turn it all? I think I turned it into plastic. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of. All right. So there is that. Does that get? Why am I doing this a difficult way? No. Press. Yeah, compressed fire clay. Yeah, I am doing it correctly. And then this gets smelted into fire bricks. That gets turned into fire bricks. So, there. I'm going to need some more lava in there. Let's grab one more piece of lava. I just, I usually just do this right in the middle of my base. That doesn't seem the smartest. But. I just need to pick it up really quick. There we go. Alright, so that gets us the fire bricks. Then this, does this get compressed again? No, work table, that's right. Work table. And water. Creosote oil, all right. Well, there we go. There is the reason for our creosote that we got. We have, we just, yeah, we can just do it that way. Can't right click on it. Maybe you can do it right click on the hatch, I don't know. There we go. There is our fire bricks. Now you don't need much of that creosote, but uh, you need some. All right. So we'll let that uh, cook away, and then let's see what else do we need? We need some iron bars. What's the chisel? Oh, there's different types of bars. That's kind of cool. <clears throat> All right, so we need six of these. Unfortunately, right now, we can't get a better ratio. We have to do it the bad way, which is pretty typical for a gray tech. You get more and more efficient at things, which I actually quite like. I like being inefficient at first and then progressing. The better and better ways to do it. All right, so we need one of those. Put the rest in there. All right, we need one bucket of lava. I'm not gonna do it yet because we may need. All right, we're done compressing. That is not what I wanted to put in there. All right, uh, let me get the rest of this stuff craft it up here and uh yeah we'll come back all right we are back and just place the fire bricks around the your daisy to get the nether bricks so we don't have to go to the nether that's pretty cool but i th i think that's everything yeah all right we also need a piece of crude steel which is in an alloy smelter a piece of coal dust charcoal dust with some iron we just got charcoal so might as well we'll do that i don't know yeah sure why not i'm sure we'll need a bunch of this so let's uh just for now we'll do the one I swear, like, these recipes have been sped up. 
much faster than I'm used to in uh, this age. All right, so we got our crystal agate. So basically we have to form this. Now, if I remember, it's a three by three by three, I think. Um, yeah. Ah, right, you need to drop them in. Eh, that's right, you need to drop it in the thing. Should I drop this down one? No, that's gonna look silly. Alright, I definitely need to get sorted how I want to. Yeah, because I need to be above this, don't I? To throw stuff in. Alright, so infernal. Keep trying to spin this. I it's not JEI. What am I doing? So twelve. Alright. Got it. One, two, three. Basically, I think it's like this, is right? And what goes? I'm like, wait a second. What goes at the bottom? What goes in that slot? <laughs> the I'm pretty sure the lava block goes in the middle. Oh, of course, it's gonna be it's gonna be obsidian because that goes there, right? And then hit it with a piece of Salus Mundus. No? Oh, I need lava in the middle. Lava in the middle. Alright, and then, yeah, I gotta figure something out with this. Alright, like that. There we go. Alright. There is our scary looking infernal furnace. Now I'm pretty sure you can put a a chest on the front of it, but uh, I think we just drop the stuff in, I think, and we get stuff out. Although I feel, oh, there it goes. Well, I did something wrong there. <laughs> All right, what did we do wrong? What did I do wrong? Where are we? Fernal Furnace. Yeah, let's just do it this way. Crude, is it... Is it steel ingots that I gotta do? Or crude steel, there we go, let's do it that way. All right, Um, I may need to... Let's see. Smelt crude steel and get some to steal a chance at a chance. It's only a chance recipe here. <laughs> that makes me that makes me sad. Um alright. I'll throw like or maybe we should get the bellows thing. But uh, I'll have to look that up. Is it arcane bellows? I mean, they're easy enough. That's easy enough to craft up. Um, I'll throw a f like four in, and then we'll see. We'll see uh, what we get, and then man, I really wanted to. I hope it's not like absolutely terrible the ratio. I don't know what the percent is, and I don't know what. Uh, I just destroyed. <laughs> no, I just destroyed iron. Uh, I need crew steel. Not just iron. Oh my goodness. All right, new pack, new uh, 
<laughs> uh, here, let's just do this. Let's just do all of it. How much iron do we have left? Uh, I'm going to have to go get more iron. Oh, and I also got a sharpening kit. While that is melting up for my sponge. I don't know if... What am I doing? Um, I'm not sure what what tools I want to be. Is it uh, is it um, like Tinkers or Greg Tech? I don't know what the intended route is. That all right? So we got twelve of that. Let's just go through all this in there. I will go mine up some more iron. And let's see what we got. So there we go. We threw 13 in there. I don't know why I'm breaking that. I'm going to have to. All right. So we're getting some steel nuggets. Not a lot, but we are getting some. I don't know how much flux this is putting out. It really kind of worries me. So I need to look into that as well. But all right, there we go. We're getting some some flux i do need you can throw a chest on the front i believe that'll put them directly in a chest nope not right there like right there maybe i don't know if that will actually do that but uh All right, there we go. <laughs> we got two steel ingots from that. All that. All that, uh, all those 12 ingots. So that, that's a thing. That, yeah, look at all the slag we got. That, uh, that's a, a ratio that uh, probably intended so we, um, so we uh, push to like the blast furnace, obviously. Um, this is just to get started, I think. All right, but uh, yeah, pretty cool multi block so far. Like I said, I will go get a lot, a lot, lot more iron for that, because as we see here, this is gonna tear through the iron that we're gonna need here, and uh, yeah. I finally got a pick that can mine the glass, so I will maybe think about getting ready for the new, like my actual base. I want like I want to get going with my like final base from the start, kind of thing. I don't want to like move halfway like I did last time. I want to get going with it as soon as possible. So uh, I needed glass and now we have glass. So that's pretty cool. I may craft up some more pure daisies and uh, yeah, we'll come back. So next episode, we'll come back and see what we can do and get into with oh, hungry chest. Oh man, hold us. I, uh, I have to say these quest rewards have been Pretty, pretty dang cool. Basically, we just put that right there. And when it throws stuff out, it'll end up in there. Man, I keep, I keep thinking that is a witch throwing a potion. It's scaring the crap out of me. <laughs> but anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. So thanks for watching and have a good one.